my god. Hold on. I miss the old Kanye, shape from the gold Kanye, chop up the soul Kanye, set on his goals Kanye, I hate the new Kanye. Hi guys, it's Anna, and today I'm going to be doing a Q&A, because I feel like you, I haven't, I've been like doing this for like about a month now, and you guys know nothing about me. <laughs> so, I've got a couple questions on my laptop here, I'm going to just rapid fire answer them. So the first one is, have you ever met someone famous? Yeah. I got VIP tickets to meet Why Don't We when I was 13. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, would you like to be famous? I would, but if I don't, it's not a big thing. If you could change one thing that happened, what would it be? Hmm, this is a tough one. I think I would change the summer of 2020 because that was a nightmare and I was my worst self during that and I'd love to never relive that again. I want to live in Los Angeles or New York City. So one of those two. Have you ever been in snow? Yes. Since the year I was born, would you be, who would be your ideal partner? Um, someone who's understanding, uh, supportive, um, kind of attractive, like looks don't really matter to me, but like it's more personality. They've got to be like understanding and accepting and supportive and loving and all that stuff because if they're not going to love me for who I am, then I can't be with them and that's that. Um, do you still have your childhood teddy bear? Yes, I still have both of them. They're at my dad's house. They're Care Bears. Next question. How many pairs of shoes do you have? Probably maybe 15. Favorite holiday, beach, mountain, or city? Definitely the beach. I love tanning. I love water. I love relaxing. Do you like TV talent shows? No. I really don't. Like, I don't, like, I don't hate them, but I don't watch them. What's your opinion on reality TV shows? I think they're good when they're not staged. Do you like scary movies? I love them. Used to hate them, but now I love them. Have you ever fired a real gun? No. Last film you watched? I think it was Matilda. <laughs> do you like roller coasters? Yes, I do. I love them. Once again, used to hate them. Now I love them. Um, have you ever cried at a film? Yes, 98% of them. What do you call your grandparents? My mom's side, I call them Nana and Papa. My dad's side is just Grandma and Grandpa. What is your favorite drink? Um, I love water, but if it's not water, I'm probably drinking a raspberry tea or peach tea, root beer, Dr. Pepper, or Sprite. Um, what was What is your favorite high school subject? I really enjoy taking orchestra and I really enjoy English. Um, what is your favorite song? Right now, it's... Um, the motto by Drake and Lil Wayne. Um, are you a dog person or a cat person? I'm a cat person. I have cats and dogs, but I have one cat and I love him to death. He is one of my best friends. Um, who has left the most impact on your life? My mom, my Nana, and my Tia. They are the three most powerful women I've ever met in my life. And they are the strongest people I know. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Do you prefer Titanic or The Notebook? I think The Notebook only because I, Rose really irritates me in the Titanic. Do I have a tattoo? No, but I do want one really bad. Do you believe in love at first sight? Yeah, yeah, I, I really do. Is that the top of your bucket list? The top of my bucket list, I really want to travel to Europe. That's one. I want to see, I want to know. No, what I want to do right now, the top of my bucket list, I want to do cliff diving. I want to dive off a cliff into water. That's num very number, number one. Um, would you ever consider living abroad? I have. I'm actually looking into colleges right now, and I have looked at some colleges abroad. Um... What is the last compliment you got? Probably that I've got a very big heart and I'm very caring and loving and selfless. Um, what is under your bed? I have travel Europe. That's one. I want to see. I want to know. No, what I want to do right now, the top of my bucket list, I want to do cliff diving. I want to dive off a cliff into water. That's num very number number one. Would you ever consider living abroad? I have. I'm actually looking into colleges right now, and I have looked at some colleges abroad. 
What is the last compliment you got? Probably that I've got a very big heart and I'm very caring and loving and selfless. What is under your bed? I have little um, storage containers for old dance costumes, sweatshirts, and sweaters. What is the scariest movie you've watched? I have no idea. Oh, probably Saw. I just watched that one recently. And it's not scary, but it's gory. And yeah. Um, what is one item you can't leave home without? Chapstick, my phone, my AirPods. If you have a nickname, what is it? I get called Anna Banana a lot. I hate it. I have to live with it. That's it. If you could pick one, would you have infinite money or unending love? Infinite money because I feel like, like if we're talking like relationship wise, I feel like you need to be in love with certain people to learn stuff about yourself. So if I was in love with one person and he was in love with me for the rest of my life, I feel like I wouldn't learn a lot about myself. So if you could choose only one, would you rather go to Paris or London? London only because Harry Potter. They've got a bunch of Harry Potter stuff down there and I'm a nerd. Would you rather live in a five bedroom apartment all, all alone or live in a one bedroom apartment with five kids? Probably a one bedroom apartment with five kids because I hate being alone. <laughs> Would you rather have a live-in massage therapist or a live-in chef? Massage therapist because I love to cook. Pick one, cheat or be cheated on. I would probably be cheated on because I don't think I could ever cheat on someone. The perfect job or the perfect relationship? Perfect job because no relationship is ever going to be perfect. And if it is perfect, it's not a relationship. Next one. Have you ever cheated on an exam? No, never. I've never cheated on a test or an exam. I've tried to, got caught. Didn't get a zero though. He just asked me to take my Apple Watch off. Um, do you believe in karma? Absolutely. A hundred percent. Do you believe in love and first sight? I already answered this one. Yes. What's your favorite candle scent right now? It is Champagne Toast from Bath and Body Works. Would you rather have an American accent or a British accent? British. I love doing a British accent. Uh, short hair or long hair? Long hair. I, I hate sh having short hair. Do you wear makeup every day? Yes. Are you a shopaholic? Yes. How many Instagram followers do you have and pictures do you have? I think I have about 900 and probably about 20. How often do you cut your nails? I get my nails done, so not very often. What's your pet's name? Uh, my cat's name is Boujou, and my two dogs' names are Minnie and Moose. Um, quality you look, in, look for in your partner. They gotta be like, spun, re not reckless, but they've gotta like, they can't be afraid to live a little and have fun. Last thing that made you cry, probably missing my ex-boyfriend. Have you done any cosmetic surgery? No, but I did have jaw surgery. I needed, my jaw was messed up. Short guy or tall guy? Tall guy. Like I, I'm, I'm average height. So if you're shorter than me, I'm sorry. Proudest moment in high school. Making it in the running for homecoming court. I was one of the nominees. Would you date your best friend? No. No. Would you consider yourself romantic? Yes. What's my full name? My name is Anna Isabella Huber and I am 16 years old. Do you eat meat? Yes. I love chicken. What's your birthday? August 2nd, 2005. What star sign on you are you? I'm a Leo. What's your favorite color? Favorite color is pink and purple. I know, basic. What's your lucky number? Two, baby. Do you have any pets? Yes, I have three. I have two cats and a dog. Where are you from? I am from Buffalo, New York. What's your height? I am 5'4". My shoe size is six to six to seven. Depends on where I go. What talents do you have? I'm a pretty good dancer. I'm a pretty good singer and I'm good at the, I play the violin. Are you good at any skills? I love cooking and baking. Are you a more artistic or mathematic person? Definitely artistic. What is your favorite animal? My favorite animal? I love cats. What's the furthest you've ever been from home? 
Florida. <laughs> what was your favorite holiday? We went to Universal for a few days and we did Cocoa Beach for a few days. That was really fun. What food do you love the most? I love Chipotle. Like, and Chicken Alfredo. Chicken Alfredo fettuccine, definitely. What sport do you like the most? I like dancing and cheerleading. Those are the two sports that I do. Favorite pizza topping? Black olives and pepperoni. What song do you love the most? Anything by Doja Cat. Anything by SZA. Anything by Kendrick Lamar. We really had te technical difficulties. There's my dream holiday. Oh, I never. My dream holiday is Hawaii or Europe. Let's skip down. I was on what film do you like the most? I love Harry Potter. I love Star Wars. I love Spider-Man. I love the Marvel movies. Uh, I love Perks of Being a Wallflower and Rocky Horror Picture Show. Favorite alcohol drink? I don't drink. I only have wine on nice dinners. What's your favorite non-alcoholic drink? Sprite and Dr. Pepper. Favorite TV show? Criminal Minds or Gossip Girl. Favorite band? Arctic Monkeys. Why don't we? Yeah. Do you want kids? Yes, I want three. Are you good at any sports? I love dancing and I love cheerleading. Are you an extrovert or introvert? I'm an extrovert most of the time and an introvert when I know absolutely no one. Are you religious? A little bit and in different ways than like regularly. What's your best achievement? Winning nationals with my dance team when I was 11 years old. <laughs> oh, what do you declare yourself? I'm straight. I love everyone. I'm accepting of everyone. I think that's all the questions I'm going to answer today. I love you guys. I hope you got to know more about me and I hope you choose to stick around. <laughs> but that's all. I love you guys and I'll see you next week. The bad mood, Kanye. The always rude, Kanye.